So it's 7.30 in the morning. I've just dropped the youngest off at daycare. We have a massive day today. Dogs. Fucking dogs are everywhere. They're just everywhere, people. Good morning, you two. Good morning, good morning. Where's the others? Oh, there's one over there. Alright, so before I even head to the office, I'm going to do a mini photo shoot because I have some new bands that we want to release, so we're going to do that. Those of you that are new to the channel, welcome. Uh, this is actually where I photograph <laughs> all our bands. Uh, it's not aesthetically pleasing, but I find that it gives us the best results. So I'm thinking that perhaps I should have gone to the office first because I really, really need the tripod to hold my phone. But we're going to make this work. I've died at least seven times. I rise on the third day every time. Soul, every soul set on fire. My soul set free sunshine. I own nothing. I own nothing. You own nothing. We're covering some serious shit up today. This is why I created Bay Bands because uh, I got grey hair and I ain't got time to go to the hairdresser today. or the wire head bands. Um, but as time went on, I realized that there was more to this than just wire head bands. Like people were asking for more. And one thing they were asking for was scrunchies. And I swore to God, like I did countless videos about how I'd never ever make scrunchies. <sighs> Two years in, uh, the Bay Band crew wore me down. Um, so we are starting to make scrunchies. This will be probably the second or third release of scrunchies we're going to be doing and i'm surprised at how popular they are i know that um a lot of people do love them but i was never a fan of them and i swore that i would never make something that i really wasn't a fan of so before i started making them i actually had to learn to love them myself um and now i am converted but anyway we won't talk about that so yeah we are doing the scrunchies now uh and two months ago we released the twist headbands with elastic and they were also incredibly incredibly popular so we're going to be continuing making those for next release so basically with bay bands uh, the company as a whole we only ever do new releases once a month and that's always the first Thursday of every month the reason being is because we do have a lot of uh, material and I am the only one doing this at the moment um, I do have a couple of other people that do help me out but um, just at the moment it is just me um, one is on holidays and 
honestly, being school holidays itself, things are a little bit slower. So when we are quite slow, I do, I do like to, to take on more responsibility, just, you know, to save on wages, if you know what I mean, um, and things like that. So we've got to get these, the scrunchies, uh, the bay bands or the wire headbands and also the twist headbands done there's only a, a couple here i mean i could smash these out in you know 10 minutes or so hopefully um so we've got to get those done oh i've got some earrings to do as well we also do uh stud earrings the reason being is obviously we have a lot of scrap material left over and i really needed something um i did i just didn't want to throw it out so I had to think of something that we could do to use the scrap material. So um, I thought of stud earrings and also we then ventured into drop earrings. So this is, I don't know if you guys can see that, that's what they look like. That's our stud earrings. Uh, another thing is I personally have really super duper sensitive ears. So uh, it took a long time to actually find uh, stud earrings and also um, drop earrings that were nickel and lead free um, and were perfect for people with sensitive earrings because I again I couldn't sell them if I couldn't wear them that that's just how it all boils down if I don't wear it if I can't wear them then I will not sell them um, so yes yeah, so we've got to get on to finishing these off and then we've got a ton, a ton of behind the scenes stuff we've got to do. Um, we've also got to sort out the next release. We are, what's the date today? The 18th of April. So we literally have two weeks to sort out our next release. I do have an idea of what's coming out next month, um, but I need to go through the material and just make sure that we have enough. And then with the material that we do already have, I've got to make sure that um, we've got to have a look at how many meters we've got. Normally, I do prefer to have roughly 10 meters of uh, each fabric because then that way I can mix it up. We can do the wire turbans, we can do some scrunchies, we can do uh, headbands with elastic and then also obviously the wire headbands as well, which is our number one seller. Um, but looking at it, I think I've got only about five meters of each. So I really need to sit down and work out what I'm going to be doing with it. That's just how we roll. Um, and yeah, so let's continue on with getting these orders out. And then we obviously we've got to pack them and move on to more behind the scenes stuff, some computer work and things like that. Too much or not angry anymore, just a little bit let down.
you will get a lot of videos uh, showing my puppies in this YouTube channel because I just love them. They're, they're, they're my babies. Yes, I've got three human babies, but they're my babies as well. But recently I just don't care. I'm a new bitch with a new style, got a new car and a new house, and I'm done. literally taken me two hours to cut all our material we had a few orders over the weekend so i've got to get those out bad habit of I've, I've got to get into this habit is sewing in our labels like our labels are the most fabulous things that I've ever seen there you go but I keep forgetting to sew them in to our products I mean what's the point of having them if I don't sew them in so what I have sewn I will just continue on and not actually sew in any labels um but must sew in labels, must sew in labels. I've got to get into that habit. Understanding, you respected every boundary. You're so exciting, was not expecting for you to be here to stay down. I don't think you know. that um, <clears throat> when I do so I put a clip at the halfway mark of our wire head wraps this is gonna sound so stupid but the reason why I do that is to remind me to put the fucking um, labels in because I get into like this zone of sewing and I just keep going and going and going and going because I've got so much to do that I just forget to put our labels on there. So that's why I do that. that I'm hesitant in putting 
this label on this particular uh, wire headband because it's double sided. So they can either wear it, you know, like that, or they can turn it over and wear it like that. Now, my thing is, yeah, it's cool having labels, but I don't want them fucking sticking out like dog's balls. So I've got to rethink how I'm going to do the labels on this. You know what I could do? I've got an idea. I've got an idea. So instead of having like, instead of having the entire label, I might actually just have a little peekaboo out the bottom so it just shows bay bands. I reckon that's the way to go. Let's try that. I know that looks really dicky because it is the wrong, it is inside out. Let's try, just cut it off. It hurts my soul doing that. Let's get our trusty paper towel holder and turn this around. see what this looks like. <laughs> Bingo. So this looks heaps better. So this is, as I said, a double sided headband. So they can go that way or that way. Didn't want the really, like it just looks dicky, the big labels, because technically it would be like that. Like that's just huge. So if you can see, I've just uh, cut the head off. <laughs> we did it. So after turning everything the correct way around, I've realized that they all look shit. The labels look shit. So what I'm gonna have to do is make sure, when I do remember to put the labels in, that we do it like that. So unfortunately, my really cool skull has got to go. She's got to go. Um, yeah. Business. quarter to one and I've pretty much finished off all the orders that have to go out. I'm hungry, really hungry. So I've come back up to my house because my office is at the other end of the property. I realized why I'm so hungry and I haven't had breakfast. So I'm going to have breakfast slash lunch and then we're going to get back down there finish off all the wide turbans that uh, have been ordered and we've just had another couple of orders through so I'll try and smash those out as well so that we're completely up to date and then got to do some admin stuff so yeah it's my day so far <laughs> oh my god can I sing to you <laughs> yeah yeah yours mine ours I could do this
this for hours Sit and talk to you for hours I wanna give you your flowers And some champagne showers All the shrimp and lobster towels But it's me that gets devoured Ooh, when you do what you do I'm empowered You give me a superpower Together the world could be ours You sit me up on the counter Instantly it's thunder showers Storming for a couple hours When we finish take a shower I could do this for hours